I bet you'd be dealing. Your family would help me out if I went to them. Oh, and I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this. Whoa, I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk <laughs> who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the <laughs> guy I am or who he really is. A school threat. What are you doing? He really is a school threat. <laughs>
<laughs> Whoa, this is loud. Hold up, hold up, this is loud. <laughs> That's a little loud in my headphones. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> okay, so this is who we are, huh? I was not expecting it to be that loud. Oh my gosh, look at the graphics. <laughs> Beautiful. What's happening? Uh, you tell me I just loaded on. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You tell me I just loaded on, gang lord. Uh, some new decision-based heat. How did I get here? And where is here? A storm. What is this, Fortnite? I'm like... Wait, there's a lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. Let's get there. I hope. Please let me make it there. But hold on, let me see. Um, do they have um a mute copyright setting? Mute copyright song setting like in the uh, true colors? They don't. All right, you said stop stalling, get into the game. You right, let's go. Resume game, let's go. Okay, use right stick to look around. Okay, uh, lighthouse. Can I run? Okay, I hold the right trigger to run. Let's get out, let's get up here, gangy. We started off on some crazy timing. Okay, they started off with a jump scare. I'm like, bro, <laughs> this, was, this is horror? I'm like, all right. Oh my gosh. It's Hurricane uh, Katrina? I'm like, Hurricane Sandy? If you see me looking off the, to the side, it's gonna make sure everything's recording, bro. You know? Gotta make sure, bro. You know? <clears throat> okay. So how do you feel about, uh, golly. I'm like, I know y'all see the top left. I told you I got games for the PS5 on me. Did we just get bodied off the rip? <laughs> I know we didn't just get bodied off the rip. If you see me looking to the side a lot. Oh, these graphics look. That was all a dream? Pieces of time. Okay, I don't want to pause all the time, but I was trying to say, um, if you see me looking to the side a lot, it's because I'm checking to make sure everything's still recording. But okay, let's go. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, These I'm in class. Everything's up. cool. I am okay. Yes, sir. To it's all just a dream. From color to chiaroscuro. Damn! <laughs> you give me an Fight back! Photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep, and... That sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. You're telling me that was real? Oh, Victoria? Why? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? This picture is cold. The class laughing at me now. If you don't post this on Instagram, that picture is cold. Because of her images of hopeless faces. Aim with the camera and press X to take a selfie. I should take a picture to prove I'm still. Plus, it's she perfect for me. And I have to get my daily selfie quota. And frankly, uh, okay. You a selfie taker for real? Do yourself. My bag? I My little camera bag is battered, but still kicking. Uh Moment of desperation. Okay. We welcome to life is strange. Me. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Let's read your journal. Did this? What would they think? July 10th, 2013. I was 10. <laughs> Actually, in July of 2013, I was I was nine. <laughs> I got accepted in the Blackwell Academy. If words could dance, this would be a rave. Even though I've never been to one, but who cares because I got into Blackwell Academy. I didn't think I would be so excited since it's not like I didn't used to live in the same town, but when I saw the text from the Blackwell Scholarship Office, I could literally feel my pulse speed up. I thought it was gonna say, sorry, thanks for playing. She thought it was a game, a simulation. It took me a few seconds before I read the whole thing. I guess I wanted to enjoy that last moment of blissful ignorance. And when I saw the first word, congratulations, I think I screamed. So I'm guessing this is her dream school, huh? My mom cried and my dad laughed. They're so weird, but they're happy. And this means extra financial support because they don't have to pay anything to Blackwell. Also, she got on a scholarship, so she's in college. Okay. This means new clothes and if I can work at a new laptop. Oh, and I have to keep telling myself in caps that I am going to Blackwell Academy, like, per period. You know what I'm saying? I doubt she's saying that, though. Okay, page two. August 18, 2013. So this is it. I'm leaving Seattle to go back to Arcadia Bay. Usually people go to the high school closest to home. I suppose I am too. It's just, I haven't lived in Seattle for five years. Out of all the best photography programs in the world, I chose to go to the smallest back in the town I was excited about leaving. Oh, so we're back in, in Seattle now. 
Maybe I wanted to come back all along just to see if Chloe and I are still even friends, but I do wish Chloe could have moved with us to s Okay, no, so she moved to Seattle, but now she's back Okay. To move with us to Seattle. The city was made for her. When we would play pirates in our rooms and in the woods, it seemed like Seattle was that fabled faraway island of treasure and adventure that we were always seeking with coffee shops. But Seattle wasn't like a fable. A contraire. Uh, now, Blackwell Academy seems more exotic to me than any other place in the world to study under Mark Jefferson, which is the teacher, I'm assuming. Uh, insert heart and f hearts and flowers. Plus, there would be cool, diverse students from everywhere. It won't be like my high school now. I never really found a group of my classmate. Or boys. I'm lucky I have a couple great friends here, but it's time to ship out. Okay, so August was when she left Seattle to come back to Arcadia Bay, which is where we are now. So we're back home. But we went to high school in Seattle, but now we're back home, okay? We're in college back home. So maybe Arcadia Bay will actually turn out to be the island of treasure I've been looking for. Treasure and adventure, okay? I'm not gonna lie, do I have to read all of this? Um, I read two pages. We could, uh, what is this stuff? Oh, this is characters. Max, Kate, Kate's the girl who got the paper thrown at her. We haven't seen who Victoria is yet, and Jefferson's the teacher. This is episodes. And what is this? I guess we could collect stuff. They have text messages too, just like in uh, True Colors. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still a little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Okay, so Max is my age. She's 18. Dad. Kate. Hey, Max. You around? Always. You okay? Did you want to get tea? So the girl who got the paper thrown of us, that's our homie. Did you want to get tea later today? Absolutely. I'll be free after. Talk to you later. Okay, so we're in class where this is our mom. Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe it's been a whole, a it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. XL. Okay, Warren. Who's Warren? Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse not to study. Please, make sure you check out Neck Romantic on my flash drive. Mahaha. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust things up. Wait, I have to study for a physics text, so if we bust anything, we also have to measure its velocity. Don't ignore this message. This man, Warren, is a simp. Max has not responded to a single one of your messages, gang lord. Okay. What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height? I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. She did say she wanted to take a picture to prove she's still here, so. To admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer... Robert okay, Max, post for your selfie. Ah. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. Oh, I got caught. A wonderful photographic tradition. Okay, Max. Has a gift. Uh, Max, you that guy? As you all know the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Uh huh. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. I mean, I'm sure. I couldn't resist. The point remains. Thank you, funny. Literature has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Okay, cool. That's cool. Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, I don't. Please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits. <laughs> um, how am I supposed to know this? I didn't. You're asking me? You're asking me, Gangle? Asking me? L let me think. Um, I hate when teachers do that. This or not, Max. Um, why are you slamming your desk, sir? Knows their stuff. Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits. This is Victoria. Like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. I know she didn't just say sad face in real life. Do this look like I message? This is real life talking about some sad face. You're a nerd. Very good, Victoria. Victoria, yep. The Garyan process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first oh, brother. Garyotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. Y'all talking too much. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Let's read the rest of her diary. Y'all talking too much. Stuff is August 25th, 2013. Stuff is crazy here. I didn't realize how much crap I had to pack until I had to pack all my crap. <laughs> mom and dad are getting a little too excited. I'm clearing out my room, though I caught my mom crying when she was packing my shirts. Damn. That made me want to cry like a little girl and never leave Seattle. Oh, so they didn't even move back. Her parents are still in Seattle. So instead of packing, I feel like burning all my clothes, then just raiding a thrift store to build up a new max wardrobe over my junior year. Not that I even have an old Max wardrobe. <laughs> Nobody will know me except for Chloe. And who knows how different we are now. So I can cut my hair, get a tat, and some piercings. 
Maybe date a cute foreign exchange artiste from Paris or Rome. I can do anything. Unless I get busted. Okay, so we gotta meet Chloe. And there will be so many super cool chances for my photography to get exposed. Thinking about that is when I get scared, but excited. And then I don't feel like crying at all. I get tingles down my arm, sensing the universe opening up for me. I can't wait to leave. I just want things to be different at Blackwell. Okay. Ma I kind of relate to Max. You know what I'm saying? She said she'd just be calling in her own little world, you know? Uh, okay. September 2nd, 2013. My first entry from my new dorm room the night before my first day at Blackwell. Whew. I haven't had any time to write or even take pictures since I got here. My stuff is in boxes all over the room, which is small, but mine, and I never want to leave. I can't wait to decorate. I plan a wall, a whole wall of photos. I didn't meet some of my dorm mates, though. I suck at remembering names, so I won't bother right now. But I think I can already see who's going to be cool to me and who's not. It's a trying to get settled into a new school and social scene after I finally found good friends in Seattle. You know, I, in my high school, I was a new kid from a whole different state for high school, bro. It sucks, bro. <laughs> Especially since everybody in my high school grew up together and then I just come in out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying? It sucks. But I'm here now and this is the start of my new life. Sweet dreams. September 13, 2013. Do you see how excited she was? And now look at this first sentence. Blackwell sucks. I told myself not to whine so soon, but damn. The day started like Christmas morning. I barely had any dreams because I was so pumped to start my first official day of my new life. Like a dork, I couldn't figure out what to wear, so I chose what was on the floor. I'm no good with names and faces right away, but I picked up some names like Kate. We know who Kate is. That's the girl who just got the paper thrown at her. Brooke, Taylor, Alyssa. And how could I forget Victoria Chase? So that's the girl we just saw. Rich, stylish, entitled. I could feel instant judgment when she looked at my raggedy <laughs> clothes. Why does Max talk like a... Alright, let me chill. As if I'm at Blackwell to strike fashion poses. Maybe I'm being extra crispy sensitive, but I think Victoria wants life here to be like her own reality show. Ugh. So she's one of them. So that wasn't fun. Oh, so she's still ranting about her first day. Okay, so that wasn't fun along with my general social unease. I thought it would be easier being back. Call the ambulance, <laughs> Max. What are you talking about? I don't want this day to end. Oh, what was Max? It was incredible to walk across the green campus in the morning mist. I love the stone step bricks and brick walls of Blackwell. Everything is a picture waiting to be taken. Speaking of, at least one great thing did happen today. Mr. Jefferson's photography class. <sighs> There's more to tell, but journal, forgive me. I'm truly wiped out, right? All right, September 4th. I have an <laughs> load of homework already. So much bullshit. At least give us noobs a day to acclimate. But to prove I'm not a total loser, I made a new friend in my science class. His name is Warren Graham. And that's the simp that was blowing up our phone. Hello. And he's a serious geek. Plus, he's dark and witty. Okay. He comes across as kind of a know-it-all, but it turns out he does kind of know a lot. We talked about photographers, and he actually named a few I'd never even heard of. We traded numbers, and he'll be a good study partner. Or a good friend. I'll need at least one based on the click action here. I thought being 18 meant I didn't have to deal with this teenage drama anymore. I thought. <laughs> I feel you. At least I get to research famous photographers for some of my homework. Mr. Jefferson assigned us a ton of reading, but this is exactly what I want to study. Jefferson is super cool and super chill. That's the thing. For college, bro, you got to find a major that you're interested in, bro. You know? He doesn't try to be too hip. Just says what he thinks and expects us all to as well. I think he's a genius. OMG, I want to marry him. Just joking. This one class is worth all the social dysfunction. Okay, so she's a photographer. She really wants to do that. Okay. September 15th. Don't worry, y'all. We only got a few more pages. Homework is kicking my ass. We just need to learn the lore, bro. Homework is kicking my ass. I bet the teacher's grade harder just to stop you from feeling special. But Victoria Chase and her snob minions still front like their honored guest of Blackwell. The bros here aren't that different. Nathan Prescott is Victoria's male clone with way more money and attitude if that's possible. Also, they're rich kids. That white entitled privilege. <laughs> His family is the oldest in Arcadia Bay and I heard stories about them when I was a kid. The Prescotts give a load of bank to Blackwell. Trust fund. Mmm. Mm. So his family funds the school so he could probably get away with whatever he wanted to because his parents put money in the pockets of the people here. So Nathan acts like he literally owns the school. Yesterday during class, he put his feet on the desk, started texting, and the teacher didn't say Jack. 
well it is also college so that's one thing they don't care about they, they're not going to care about as much and then <laughs> you know when your parents fund the school i guess right I'd get suspended, but him and Victoria are part of this silly elite vortex club that puts on popular parties and so they get their way. It's good to be the king and queen. This sounds like more like high school than college, bro. I don't want to slam everybody. I do like Kate Marsh. That's the homie. She's down the hall in one of my classes. She's so pretty and sweet and friendly. It makes her more beautiful than the biatches here like Victoria who think beauty is just your face and outfit. See, I'm already playing their drama games. No more. Uh, okay, Max. September 23rd. Finally had a chance to take some actual shots around campus today. A perfect blue sky day. I always forget how great I feel after I take pictures when I've been slacking off. Speaking of pictures, Mr. Jefferson told us about the National Everyday Heroes photo contest he wants us all to enter. I'm assuming that's when we saw the picture of her, of the picture of her looking at the wall of photos. That's what she was talking about turning in because she said, I can't turn this into Mr. Jefferson. The winner gets a trip to San Francisco and lots of publicity. He wants just one photograph from each student. This is exactly why I wanted to come to Blackwell. And of course, I'm scared to answer, so she's shy. At least I have a couple weeks before the deadline in October, so I have plenty of time to stress and procrastinate. <sighs> like a true teenager, stress and procrastination is key. I don't know whether I love it or hate- Oh, September 30th. Oh, these entries are spaced out. I don't know whether I love it or hate it here. I'm trying to keep up with my science class of all things like I give it or even understand it. Good thing I know Warren. Too bad I can't clone him to take my place in class. Miss Grant is much cooler than the class. She explains particle physics so even boneheads like me can kind of understand. I love how she relates society to science and vice versa. I can tell she's committed and passionate about life, unlike some of us in her class. <laughs> but I'm trying to engage more, even if it means asking actual questions in class instead of hiding in the back. Oh, the anxiety of asking questions in class takes me back. Takes me back. <laughs> I'm just glad I'm not the only social misfit here. Now, how much homework are you avoiding? Okay, final page. October, my favorite month. Really? My favorite month is... The most wonderful time of the year. December, January. Y'all know that's my favorite months. Uh, the best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. But it's still too damn hot. Thanks, global warming. Oh, brother, how that aged almost 10 years later. That's crazy. 2013 is almost 10 years ago. Wow. And I can't bust out and I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters or scary movies yet. Soon though. Kate, let me borrow The October Country by Ray Pratt Bradbury. I haven't read much about him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek cred before I held up my copy of Battle Royale. Fortnite, like, but he nails the autumn atmosphere of small towns. The last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a real party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. It's that or a Vortex, Vortex Club Stroke Fest swimming party. Or is that Backstroke Fest? What? You so punny, Max. Okay, Max kind of cool. I messed with Max already. At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy as my parents love telling me on a loop. You have all the time in the world. Yeah, people say that, and realistically, we do, but as a teenager, do not feel like that. You can okay. find out all about him in your textbook. Damn. Even you gonna come in my ear like that? Thank you, class is over. <laughs> Hey guys, don't I investigated everything. Photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. Yep. Fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. Yeah. Exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So yes, sir. And Alyssa, get it together. That, uh, we know Alyssa. I'm still waiting for you. We know Taylor. I see you pretending not to see me. Why are you looking at me, gangy? I'm like, uh, this gate, yo, these PS5 graphics look amazing, bro. Oh my gosh. Let's see what the homie Kate doing. You gonna let her throw a paper at you? Just a second, kissing ass. Look at her trying to riz him up. Let me talk to my friend. What's good, gang lord? Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Let's see what they threw at you, though. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Purge. Dear Kate, we love your video. XOXO Blackwell Academy. Kate got her tape leaked? Oh my gosh. Kate, you got your tape leak, Gangi? How you feeling? You cool? Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. She looks like she needs sleep. Uh, I hope I didn't embarrass you. You seem quiet today. What's good, Gang? Thinking too much. 
don't want anybody mm. excluded from this process. Wants to grab a cup. She says she wanted tea. Hear that? Want to go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? <laughs> uh. Not today. I have to go over homework. Okay. Let's hang later. Uh, she got a cross on her neck. She says she believe in the man above. Ah, but you got a tape out. That's not her doing though. You know, that's not her fault. What is this? I can use the computer? It's like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Hmm. This cool talented? What y'all doing? Photoshop? We got Honestly, Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Right. What's this print? I'm looking at everything, bro. Don't get mad at me. Y'all know I do this. It's amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. Uh Max, what is it? a whole gallery show with that thing. Uh, what is this for? Suck. <laughs> Someday. Come on, Max. That picture you showed was clean. Let's see. Let's see Max's drip though. You got the Converse on, the skinny jeans. She she does have that 2013 aesthetic. The good times. <laughs> the good times. That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. So this everybody. I didn't want to be in the picture at all. It was fairly fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. So there's Victoria, black guy. Stella's the girl with the pink hoodie. We don't know who the fat dude is. We don't know who the pink hair girl is. There's me, Max, and then Kate behind me. And then I think th the guy said that's Taylor with the blonde hair. So we know Taylor and uh, Kate. Photo equipment. Let's see what's this going on. I'm looking at everything. Carbon fiber tripods here. The ball head even has a pan lock. God, I'm such a photo. <laughs> I was just about to say, okay, Max is a geek about what she's passionate about. Just like me. I relate to Max. I'm Max. The books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. That's Victoria, I'm assuming? Is this her tablet? Of course. Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. So this is Victoria's stuff. Man, I'm finna boom gang this. Give me that. Known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. 5,000 for a camera? Oh my gosh. She really is rich. I'm like, let's take a photo. Yeah. They give me the options. Rachel Amber forever. Okay. Can we know of Rachel Amber? No, we don't know who that is yet. Uh, I got a trophy? Oh, wait, journal. Journal. Oh, so the, oh, so each, each episode, I have special things to take pictures of. And then I could miss it or collect them all. So I got one out of the ones this episode. Okay. And you know, it's going to be, I think this is kind of, if I remember correctly, Life is Strange is similar to Telltale. Like you saw how we did True Colors. Like it's one long episode. So we'll probably split it into two parts, things of that nature. But yeah, you know, but uh, I'm excited to be on some decision base. Never escaped the lighthouse here. That's where we just were with the storm. That's where we just were. Oh, I could take a picture. Oh, I thought it said picture. Uh -huh. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Dang. So they're in like a woodsy small town, huh? Because they said Nate's family's the oldest in the town. Like, what type of town is this? They got a TV? I'm like, let me see. And he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Victoria. Wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Uh, remember putting on movies on in class? Victoria, what is that fit, bro? Your fit trash. I'm not gonna lie, I'm out of here. Y'all whack. I'm going on to my next class. Max Caulfield, don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your injury. My fault, OG. Uh, my fault, Gangi. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Um. I didn't have any time. I've been real stressed out with classes, you know? Time. Way too much. She did say that in her journal. You're a better photographer than a liar. Damn. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. You don't look that old, Gengi. I won't wait for you to play catch up. You're Bex. The world is yours, blah, 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 right? Yeah, same thing everybody says. You have a gift. You have the fever to take images. To frame the world only the way you envision it. Oh. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Mm, okay, he talking, he talking, he talking, he talking. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Bro, Victoria, she talking about she pretty. She look like a boy in the face with that cut. Like, who bar who's your hairstylist? This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. 
Damn, Max, you really like him like that? And look, she got no kick. All right, let me chill. <laughs> let me chill, Roaster. I'm out of here. We talked about our photo. Let me out. He's one of the, Tell me how cute he's one of those teachers. If the bell doesn't dismiss you, I do. Why is it ringing then? Cute. Huh. Golly. Who the hell is that? Why is she built like that? All right, let me stop body shaming. Oh my gosh. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Right? Everybody's talking. It's stressing me out. Make sure I don't look like a total loser. Uh, Square Enix. Okay, welcome to Life is Strange, the original. <laughs> Hello. What we doing, Max? Oh my god, they talking smack about me? Don't nod entertainment. Oh, is this copyright? Oh, Max, you gotta put me on your playlist, Max. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, whoa, whoa. I guess a walk. Life is Strange Remastered, Episode 1, Chrysalis. Ugh, I'm excited to be here. Ah, that fit trash. I know your ankle's cold. Evan doesn't say much to me, but... This is definitely copyrighted. Y'all gonna have to read sub subtitles. That's Alyssa. Watch it, bro. You see me walking, ganglore. Locker. I could open. Whose locker is this? Oh, this is my locker. Oh, so this is my locker. Okay. They really just blasting copyright music. Good thing I'm not streaming this game. You good, Gangatron? Stella. This is Stella is. Who's this, Justin? Justin Bieber? This looked like Justin Bieber in 2013, though. Y'all know that was just swag back then. Hold up, Dana. Hello. <laughs> Hello, my name is Max. Does Max even roll that way? Let me chill. Yeah, I was gonna say, Dana kind of... Oh yeah, Dana kind of cool. If I was at the school, I would have to holla at Dana on me. Logan. Oh, Daniel, that's the dude in our class. <laughs> Jock Straps. He really pressing you. Fight back, bro. Daniel, fight back. Daniel. I can't look at Daniel. Okay, he really just smacking your face. Couldn't it be me. <laughs> Couldn't it be me. Oh, Rachel Amber! That when it just said Rachel Amber forever on the desk. It's because she's missing. April 22nd, 2013. Damn, she's 19. Damn, Rachel. Hope you get found soon, Gangi. Mm, she like spooky season. Okay. Look at this scene. This scenery. There's just a vibe right now. <laughs> Alright, she gave me a summary. I don't have to read all that. You know, I like looking at stuff. Over the past decade, climate change has altered the Oregon course line, and few, including fish and fauna. This has helped decimate the state's fishing industry, especially in Arcadia Bay. Damn. So, th yeah, we are back in Arcadia Bay. That's Rachel Amber again. Gun free zone. What, Max? She just said that so casually. You want some eats, Max? You hungry? Don't? Okay. Okay. Who is this? Hayden. Who's Hayden? Okay, Hayden's gangy. Hayden's cool then. Okay. <laughs> so that's the vortex club that all the rich kids are part of okay i can't walk faster who is this trevor what's good gangi i'm learning about everybody okay so max max the, okay okay max she do, she do look like she would like a skater boy huh okay max i feel you who are these people juliet Y'all yeah, don't see me just looking over here judging y'all. I'm like, I 
Okay, so Zachary's a job. Juliet's ver Who is that? If you don't back up, try to press Samuel. What's good, gang lord? Damn. Okay, we're supposed to go to the bathroom. Now I'm getting sidetracked just at the scenery. Ugh. Who's this? this is oh, this is Miss Grant, the homie. What's good, gang lord? She built more like a lunch lady, if you ask me. I got a map. Alright, let me stop stalling. I'm just appreciating the scenery. I'm appreciating scenery. I know y'all probably like... That's the principal office out there the bathroom. I know y'all like... If you don't hurry up and get on with the progress of the game, I'm unsubscribing and clicking off. Where's the bathroom? Is this it? Woman, bathroom. And this the men bathroom? Okay. Alright, let's go. Woman bathroom. This is where Max wanted to go. Let's go. Enter. Let's go. They blasting this copyright music. I'm sorry I had to read all those subtitles. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. Okay, thank you. Turn that copyright off. That music was a vibe, though. This game's a vibe. It really makes you feel that 2013 nostalgia. All right. Uh, what are we finna do, gang lord? What is this? Now, who would bother to write that crap? Rachel Amber is a the missing girl. What is wrong with you? Error. Poster. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of how vaccines work, bro. They give you a little bit. Tampon dispenser. They really have this? I'm good to flow. Thanks. They really have that in a bathroom? Okay, that's cool. In a woman's bathroom? Okay, that's cool. I hate Victoria Chase. I get. I bet Max will agree with you on that one. Hold on. This poster must drive people to have sex. Abstinent makes the heart grow fonder. Kate twerks for God. Oh my gosh, they really trying to bully Kate. So you want to use the only mirror that has writing on it. Nice. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Oh yeah, we still didn't even get to explaining that dream. Okay, you need cold water on your face. Let me hurry up and get to the... I know y'all like hurry up. I know, I know, I know. Uh, this game, this game, it's just the stuff. Okay, Max, y'all fit kind of cool. I'm not going to hold you. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. It's very much 2013, and I like it. I miss 2013. Fuck it. Just the aesthetic of 20. Why you ripped the picture? Now you got to take a look. That pic was cold. You could have posted on Instagram. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. That butterfly is very blue, Gengachan. Want to take a picture of it? Hey girl, you don't get a photo op yep. like this every day. Uh, okay. Let me go take this picture. Don't fly away, butter. Butterfly. Butterfly. Say cheese. I know that picture looks hard, Max. Let's see it. So Max really uses, like, old school cameras. Because even in 2013, this type of camera is old school. That, uh... Um, this is the women's bathroom. Who is this? This man looks like Tom Holland. <laughs> oh, Nathan. Hey, bro, just come to three. Nathan Prescott. Nathan Prescott. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. Oh, he is school threat. He is school threat. He is school threat. What do you want? Who is this? You check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Now. Let's talk business. I got no Let's talk business. You got hella cash. That's hella cash. Not me. Oh, boo hoo, poor little rich kid. Damn. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet you'd be dealing. Your family would help me out if I went to them. Ooh. And I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. Whoa. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you He really is a school threat. What are you doing? He really is a school threat. Never tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. I'm like I'm hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! I felt the vibration from the gunshot in the controller. PlayStation, y'all did y'all thing with the PS5. He really blinked it. Whoa. What the fuck? <laughs> I forgot that's what she could do. <laughs> I forgot that's what she could do. Oh, let me be quiet. How can that be? I forgot she could do that first. 
He shot that poor girl. And you're crying about it. He held up my hand. And then I was back here. She said, hell no. Nah. <laughs> she said, hell no. Nah. I already heard this lecture. Brought us right back to the start. To shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. Yeah, we read without what was in that. Victoria's phone rings. This is real. <gasps> oh, shit. Can you give me an example of my camera? The human condition in black and white. Okay. If Hold crazy. Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Left trigger to Can oh. I actually reverse time. Let's see. Eee! Yeah. Where my camera at? Where my camera at? So she goes out of her body. I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured a human, human time machine. That's fire! Anybody? Okay, okay. Now I know for y'all who watch Life is Strange True Colors, I know y'all already like her power better than Alex's. Like, I, Life is Strange True Colors, it was cool, but if my nostalgia and memory is correct, this game is the best out of all of them. You know what I'm saying? And you saw by her power. <laughs> she said, uh, uh. All right. Max. Don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Okay, we looked at everything already, so. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally. If everything goes. Sophie Jefferson asked me a question. Yeah, we already investigated everything the first. As again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. This is crazy. Has a gift. I know um, I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, it's real. Has been I can tell. Imagine how much of a trip this is, bro. So I can go back in time. That's fire. Selfie. How far back can we go, though? That girl isn't dead yet. I can I save her? Max, you're going to be a superhero? And photography I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Say that. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation... Why he looks so angry about it? Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. What did Victoria say? <laughs> um, I don't feel good. Can I go to the bathroom? I have to use the bathroom. But I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. I hate when teachers used to do that, bro. Like, how are you gonna tell me I don't have to go piss or boo-boo? Well, it's not boo-boo. We not boo-boo in the school bathrooms. We not like Jael. I know y'all saw the stream highlights video. Shout out to homie Jael, but he be boo-boo in the school bathroom. How you gonna tell me if I had to take piss or not? If you don't let me go for I piss in your trash can? We can talk more after class. Oh my gosh. Shit. Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. What did she say? You're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad this is not iMessage, this is real life. What if I rewind again? This icon means you learned a useful fact that you may be able to use if you rewind. Extreme. While rewinding, hold R2 to rewind faster. So I could take information I learned. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation. And then I could skip. Oh, now the decision choice base comes in, so now I can answer his question. Process. Invent uh, around 1830. Sad face. Like, reading as well as posing. Nice work, man. You know me, I'm a jack of all trades. Look at her salty. She couldn't say sad face. Hugely popular. Yeah, stare. What you want? Jack's clear to find features. Look like 11. Learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. Uh. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes Cup. I can't rewind any further. San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it. So I could take information that I learned in present. So the only thing, so Max is not affected by when she goes back in time. Everything else is, though. That's, that's fire. That's fire. Okay. Together. Taylor, don't hide. So I could retain all information. I see you pretending not to see me. Yes, we know. Let me go talk to you. You are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Okay, I can't rewind any further. This is going to stay there the whole time. I already looked at everything. Let's talk to Kate one more time, though. Hi, Sir Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Here, want to talk. Did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? Oh my gosh. I'm just tripping. Too much stress. Imagine how much of a trip this is, bro. Uh, I wish we didn't. I wish we didn't what? 
I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. See you later, home. Kate, Kate's the homie. I feel bad for Kate, bro. All right, Mr. Jefferson, come on. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Victoria Shoe. For a moment. Yes. Excuse. I don't care, bro. Excuse. Right. Get out of my face. One of photography's future stars avoid handing in. Victoria, like ain't nobody care. Uh, not sure if I have one. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about. A thousand picks by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. He liked me. Don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Oh, that's a bar. Don't let me stop you. That's a bar. You can't press to quickly undo your previous action during the rewind. Press. Oh. So the dot is where. I also want everybody to know. So the dot is where I get to. So now photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. So now I could say what he said to me. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said. <laughs> what happens while you're busy making other plans. Uh! Today, all the right answers. Good. <laughs> Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. You know me, Gengi. You know me, Gangi. I'll see you later. Victoria, you smell like fish. Close your legs. I'm like, let's go. <laughs> uh, I'm out of here. Back to the bathroom. That is fire. Get to the bathroom. Please. Okay, we already did investigating on the first run through. Move! I'm crazy. Yeah, I'm out of here. Hold up, Dina. What's good, baby? Ah, she look good. All right. Uh, 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 where was the bathroom? Where was the bathroom? Where was the bathroom? Where's the bathroom? Right here, right here, right here. I'm out of there. I could run too. Thank you. All right, let's go. So bathroom. Hey Max, retrace every step. Bathroom. Take, wash my face. Take a picture of the butterfly. Okay, they don't have to. Okay. Photo. Yeah. Then the butterfly flew in. Hey, you took a picture of the butterfly. Photo. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I know I can't rewind any further. Them out of this. Okay, here we go. Tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't oh my gosh. I am or who you're messing around with. Wait, what are we doing? What are you doing? What are we doing? Come on, put that Ever. thing down. You retain facts and inventory objects? Okay. It's happening again. Um, um, um. Going to get in hella more trouble I need a hammer to break it open. Um, cart. Even missed your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. Okay, I got the hammer. Time again, I can help her. I got the hammer. Okay. Then drugs. Nobody. Yep, 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 yep. Missed your punk ass, would they? I'm a superhero. I'm a superhero. I'm a superhero. Never touch me again. Yeah, Nathan, you school threat. Get off my girl, uh, Avril Delevingne, if that's how you say her name. Y'all know who I'm trying to talk about. Another shitty day. Yeah, you school threat. I'm a superhero, Supermax. Not happen. This cannot be real. Super Max, Super Max. Our girl gets shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? You tell me, Gangi. Let's get out of here, though. Freak out. Oh my! Imagine being Max in this situation. <laughs> I would think I'm doing drugs. You hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. That's where I'm going, sir. Bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. What? For what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in gear. If you don't move. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? I was trying to go, but you stopped me. Listen, the situation is under control. There's no emergency. Who is that? Samuel L. Jackson's cousin? Please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Right, bro? You, look like you smell like beer and axe. Get out of my face with that. I'm trying to get out the building, but you're the one talking to me about it. Like, what's good, Gengi? How you feel? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max- You look like a raisin in the face. Back up! Report Nathan, hide the truth. If I report Nathan, they're not gonna do nothing because his parents put money in the school's pockets. So, but then if I, they can't ignore that, right? Hmm, report, hide the truth. Huh, 
I want to report Nathan to the cops. The school not going to do nothing. Hmm. School not going to do nothing. School not going to do nothing. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? My fault? I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. Bro. Nothing to hide. I got sick. What is up with y'all harassing girls in this school? Team toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think um, what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks and you're already causing conflict. How? Parents will approve when they find out. How? Side with class. Please. This man. No, he does This action will have consequences. Okay. He just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. We got rewind, reverse. He could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Max, you good, Genki? Yeah, rewind and tell him the truth. How do I know when to stop? What the hell? Can I speak to him again? Don't wander around here. Get on outside. I can't rewind. Okay, I'm out of here then. I can't rewind on choices. Okay, I thought I could. <laughs> so I could only rewind on dialogue, huh? Interesting. Interesting. But he told. But how are you gonna get mad at me because I'm feeling sick? How are you gonna tell me how I feel? Like on my face with that. Hmm. This camp is cool. Blackwell Academy. Where does it take place at? Oregon? Is Arcadia Bay a real place or is it a fictional place at Oregon? Talk to me. Oh, uh, this camp is... Life is Strange always got nice scenery, bro. Yeah, so true color scenery was beautiful. Okay, missing post in person. That's Rachel Amber. Miss Grant, the gangy. What's good? Can I talk to her now? Hi, Miss Grant. Hey. Hey, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition. But would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? I got you. Max likes you, so I got you. I always have time for you. Yeah. What's the petition? This the homie. David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Mm. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms. Oh, he a pervert. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Oh, this is a high school. That's crazy. David Madsen. David Madsen doesn't need another excuse to harass students. He right, he just harassed me. Personalities. This is about protecting civil rights and our school's legacy of freedom. Oh. Academy has a noble heritage from the Native Americans who founded this land. Uh. Pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Okay, Miss Grant, talk that real. Blackwell is that old? <laughs> you know a lot. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. Oh. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. Oh, uh, okay. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Uh, okay. Before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? I got you, gang lord. I got you, homie. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. Yeah, that's weird. He's already a creep. Favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Ah, uh, I need her on my side. Clearly, the print, this actual will have consequences. Man, what? David's gonna try and harass me again? Then I'll just get the principal on him. <laughs> well, the principal don't like me, but I'll get Miss Grant on him. What's good? Oh, Hayden. Max said he's cool. There's Hayden in his Vortex Club harem. <laughs> he sure is living the dream. He really got a harem of white woman. That's crazy. Hayden. What's good? And Black History Month. She is the retro selfie master. He look like That's Barack. Funny. You look relaxed as usual. You look like young Barack. Skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Uh. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Yeah, trust fund baby. Not to boast. My fault. Vortex Club, Nathan Preston. Let's talk about the Vortex Club. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? Yeah. It seems so elitist. Put me on. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If mm. you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. Gossip? I'm new here. Hang with Vortex? Hang with a Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Right? Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. Just from the way you worded that, I'm cool. Partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to have- How am I high? She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like. 
you know. Victoria? Uh, let's talk more about Rachel. I'm intrigued. You knew Rachel Amber. Yeah. I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. I don't like the way he talks, bro. Did Victoria like Rachel? What happened to her? Rachel was in the Vortex Club. Did Victoria like Rachel? Victoria like Rachel? She seems like... She probably didn't. I don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel. Even if she didn't act like it. Respect and like is two different things. Rachel was actually <laughs> a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. Mm. And I'll deny I ever said that. Okay. What happened to her? What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to Why he looks here without a trace? Why he looked like he was involved with it? Let's talk about Nathan though. You really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Yeah, he is school third, bro. Please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He just wanted to kill a different and a fun guy to hang with. The hater. Until you press him about who he really is, he seems unstable. Fair enough, I'm cool. I'm not. But I'm still not going to. Park yeah. Your loss, bro. It's fucking hilarious when he's blade. And then when he talk about. Always have the best shit. And then when he talk about blowing. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Bro, Dana's mind back off. He talking about Nathan's cool. Wait till y'all get high and Nathan ups the Glock and talks about blowing up the school again. Who's this, Brooke? Let's go, Brooke. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Um, not with that attitude, but I'd love to. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and this is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? Oh my gosh, you're trash. Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Um, you a, all right, you a clown. Can I, can I steal something from her bag? I'm almost sure Warren has the same bag. It looks a bit nerdy though. I'll probably have to distract her if I want to do that. <laughs> what was that? Warren. Hi, Max, can you get my flash drive? I need some info in space. Hello. Sorry running late and same day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Okay, so we're going to have to go to the uh, parking lot with Warren. I know this game all to a slow start right now. Oh, we got more journal entries. This does not exist. This will be the... Okay, so we get a more look into her mind with this. This will be the weirdest journal entry I will ever make. So weird, I don't know how or where to start. But it started with the most vivid dream of my life. I was lost in a storm by the lighthouse until I came to the edge of the cliff. That was the beginning of the game. Then I saw a giant tornado headed for Arcadia Bay. It was so real that I could feel the rain stinging my face. And I was scared. Then a boat hit the lighthouse and I swear I actually felt like I was going to die. But I woke up in Mr. Jefferson's class and I wasn't even sleeping. I almost fell out of my chair. Jefferson called on me but I totally blew the answer. Of course Victoria pounced on me and made me look like a bigger idiot. She's so awful. Then I didn't have the guts to turn in a photo for the Everyday Heroes contest while Victoria did her usual suck up to Jefferson. He's so cool and he clearly wants me to succeed. Yeah, you're his favorite student, clearly. Alright, so that's basically just a recap. to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Okay. Where's the dorms at? Where is the dorms? Okay. So, Mr. Jeff, I'm Mr. Jefferson's favorite student. That's why he wants me to succeed so bad. Um, Rachel Amber. What is this? I can, can for a burger now. I can get lost in this game so easy, bro. This this scenery is just fire. Let's get Justin Bieber. Uh, what album are you working on next? Talk to me. Yo, Justin. Let's get the Max. Come to thrash. Uh, I got my fasher hoodie on. I got my fasher hoodie on. Thrash? You mean stage diving or? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Okay. See me. See me. Oh, Justin. Check. See me. Ah. Uh. No slide. But I'd love to see somebody. Ah. Uh. You're not a poser. Nah. I just can't skate worth shit. <laughs> Check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Ah. Uh, I want to see a tray flip. A tree flip. I already know what a no slide looks like. For that act. Ah. Uh, let's see. Ah. Uh. 
Yay! Oh my. Oh, he hit himself in a dingling. Guess who's the poser now? You can watch us destroy these rails. Uh, okay. So I could have went back to talk to her. I'm cool off her though. Let's get to the dorms. Let's get to the main story. Bro really hurt himself because I said I want to see a tray flip. You good, Gangi? <laughs> I can take the picture. That man is down bad. So this is how I get the extra pictures. Okay. I wonder if those help me. I wonder if those help me. Yep. So what else? There's a bird. A bedroom, a RV, a squirrel, a broken glass, a photo wall, a beach, and I don't know who that old man is. But none of those look like um any anything to do with that girl. Uh, this game, I love this game, bro. This game, fa. What's up, Daniel? This is who was getting bullied earlier. Hi, Max. Could I um ask you a question? Yo, f you got a neck, bro. And letting me sketch you. I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd be honored. Let's see what you got. Yeah. Makes me feel like a muse. Let's see what you got. Let's. <laughs> you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. What's a muse? I hear that a lot. Angel Amber. Oh, I don't like the way you say that. Hearts of what? You knew her? You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. You sound weird saying that. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Right? Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Uh, she had a good heart. Hmm. So what happened to her? There's gotta be a- So Rachel Amber's gonna be a big part in this story, huh? Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. Oh my gosh. I hope she's okay. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. <laughs> no way. You're a- Good substitute muse. Don't play my girl Max like that. Max cool. I would want to be friends with Max in real life. She cool. That's a good posture. She remind me of me as a as a white girl. <laughs> if I was a white girl, I feel like I'd be Max. Max cool. She not ugly either. She cool. Good. Good. I don't like his voice, bro. He sounds creepy. He sounds like a pervert. Like he finna take these pictures and put them on his wall and do something to him. Oh my gosh! He is talented! Can I take a picture? Can I take a picture? This action will have consequences? Can I take a picture? Max, I'd like to draw you another time if you want. How are you going to draw me and then I can't take a picture of, of my drawing? That's one of his famous shots. I love how it captures the moment. Oh, this is Mr. Jefferson's pictures. Okay. Who's over here? I'm, I, know, I know we have a lot of other stuff to do, but I'm just immersed right now. I'm getting immersed in the story. Yeah, these videos might be longer. Clever. Vortex Club sucks. Who is this? Who's Luke? What's good, Luke? You good, Gengi? Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. What's wrong? What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. What did he do? He own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of- Yeah, he just had a blick to some blue haired girl. Brick down. Whoa. Yeah. Take himself down. Yeah, history always proves that, right? Just wait for justice, you sheeple. Thank you. I'm not even rewinding for you. Your conversation was useless. Who's that? Go to the dormitory. Let's go. Uh, I hope y'all enjoying this so far. I know it's a slow, it's a slow start, but I'm having fun, bro. I'm actually having fun playing this. You know, I'm immersed. <laughs> I'm immersed. New story. Just you just gotta be a little patient. I hope y'all enjoying it though. This this game fire so far. Bring it, bruh. Yeah. So we gotta go to the dormitories to get a flash drive for Warren. Okay, cool. This is the dorms. How is this a high school, though? Go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. So get the things for Warren, and then, um... They're playing football? Oh, it was good. I know Alyssa. Oh. Hi, Max. What's good, Gengi? How are you? How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. <laughs> Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. Let's hope not. I think you're better off reading chiclet. Right. Point. Now if you'll excuse me. Okay, Gangi. Talk to you later. All right. Time to get to the dorms. Move. Move. Let me get to the dorms. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What are you calling a hoe, fat? What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls no. for your wave hipster bullshit. 
You just mad at I'm his favorite and you wanna suck him off, like You could barely even say that. I got it right, didn't I? That's filled. <laughs> and who are these groupies? These airheads. Fake Barbie dream house. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh brother. Oh wait. Hold that pose. No. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Okay. I'll much- Victoria, I'll get your bony ass out of my way. <laughs> uh, I'll much rather go with a girl like Max before I go with a girl like Victoria. Get out of here with that, Victoria. You, that That's that white privilege entitled stuff, like, corny. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. Oh, Samuel! Get Victoria the hell out of the way. What's good, Samuel? Just the gang. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Yeah. Paint the window. <laughs> Don't tell me we're gonna have to do what I think we're about to do. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Sprinklers. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Oh. Okay. Okay. So that's what we're finna do. So he he painted up there. So I'm supposed to do something with the paint. I'm supposed to do something with the paint. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Can I use it? Hmm. So they got some puzzle solving. Okay, so uh Okay, 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 okay. So I somehow have to get the paint. Okay, 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 okay. So we have to use the sprinklers to get them to move? Or do we spill the or or we do the paint? Interesting, interesting. Okay, okay, okay. Or do we get one of them to... Yo, y'all trying to throw a football at Victoria, Genki? Interception! What the hell just happened? Only one way around this. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell? Okay. Ah, duh. Rewind, rewind, rewind. I thought... <laughs> I thought it fit. Let's go all the way back. All the way back. All the way back. There we go. There we go. Okay. So, we have to mess with the paint can. Mess with the paint can. Okay. We gotta mess with the paint can. Okay, let's see if this works. And then, when Samuel gets up there, I think I mess... Okay. Do I mess with the sprinkler first, or... Huh. Do I have to mess? Let me let me see if I mess with the sprinkler first. Hold on. Use. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. So I mess with the sprinkler. Water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. So then she moves to where the paint is. Nice. Now she moves where the paint is, and then the paint falls on her, right? Did I do it right on my second try? Hold up! I thought I'm the greatest detective, bro. I do this. Did it not work? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Yup! Yup! Greatest detective for a reason, bro. Brain power. Don't talk to my mans like that. Yeah. Karma. 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 It worked. Don't mess with Max. Uh, don't mess with Max. Don't mess with Max. Ha <laughs> ha. Look at you. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Can I get to my dorm? Make fun of comfort? I'm not going to belittle myself to her level. I'm trying to get to my dorms. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there will be another. Uh. Can I get to some? You always seem to know how to pick the right outfit. I mean, be nice. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon esque. Ah! Uh, see? My heroes. Thanks, Max. No problem, girl. See, kill him with kindness. I hope the sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. <laughs> see, we could turn her into our friend instead of a rival. See? Okay, kill him with kindness. Can I go to my dorm? shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself. Uh, you see? No. Oh, my controller. But no. pretty fun. Uh, you see? Kill him with kindness. Those days, you know? 
I feel you. Exactly what you mean, Victoria. Ah. Uh, I'll see you later. See, she's not that bad. She's not all bad. She's not all bad. She's so it's all about choice. You see, decision based, bro. This actual she probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. Nah, kill him with kindness, bro. We're not gonna bring ourselves down to her level, bro. Always gotta be the bigger pair. I'm not, you know, win, play stupid games, win stupid prizes, bro. You know, she wanna be mean to me. I'm gonna be nicer. I'm a killer with the kindness. That's what I do. Not gonna uh, get my energy off for you. You see, she cool, and I got her out my way. But I still ended up playing her realistically. <laughs> realistically, I ended up playing her. Okay, map. Let's see which dorm is mine. Welcome to Black Hill. My dorm is 219, Victoria's is 221, Kate is 222, Dana is 218. Dana! Talk to me, Dana! Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Yeah, go go Barbie and, um, um, I don't, I don't know an Asian woman. Red rum. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Who's room 17? Who's 217? Welcome to Black Hill. Stella Hill? Oh, it's, oh no, Stella's in my class. Taylor is a slave. What? Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Right? Truly pathetic. Stomping Bigfoots. Read this week's edition of the Blackwell Totem. Okay. What is this? It's Rachel's photo. These dorms is kind of cool. I just personally wouldn't want to be in a dorm myself. Okay, the shower rooms is broken. Uh, that's useless stuff on the board. Ah, damn! All this damn toilet paper. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Fire alarm? I'm not finna pull that. I'm not finna pull that. Two, two, two. Who is this? Will Bangford. What the hell? Is this is this um Kate's draw dorm? Not disrespect my homie like that. Ah, peace, love, and positivity. This actually have consequences. So that's not necessarily bad. I feel like they put it there, so it makes it seem like it's bad. Be the change you wish to see. Which one's my room? Is this mine? Yeah, this is mine. Let's see. Let's draw something on our slate. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Let's add something, Max. Come on. <laughs> Let's add something, Maximus. Uh, Max! Oh, no. Her name's Maxine. We gotta come up with a nickname for her other than Max. Max. Uh, okay. We need this flash drive for Warren. And then we go to the parking lot. To the parking lot for Warren, yeah? Yeah. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Oh, this dorm kind of clean on me. This dorm kind of clean. Ah. Note. Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just more stressed. I feel you, Max. 18? 18. <laughs> 18 is crazy. Hi, honey. Your principal sent me an email saying that he is concerned about your attitude and behavior, that you are not fitting in well and hiding in your dorm. I know it's hard to be away from home even if you are all grown up now, but you are there to change the world with your camera. Please call me soon to chat. We miss you. XXOO mommy. Aw. Max has a nice mom. Uh, let's take a flick. Selfie. Selfie for the IG. Ah. But speaking of the thing with Victoria, right? She said Victoria played me. I should have played her. We did play Victoria. We ruined her fit. <laughs> We ruined her fit. Um, Teddy Bear, let's see. Captain, at least I know you've got my back. Uh. Swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER. <laughs> I knew we were bonded forever. Oh, uh, this is where, this is the photo wall where she took the picture in front of. I'm not trying to lay down right now. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day mom and I sewed that together. Aw, uh, memories, man. Memories. <laughs> I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. Oh yeah, she did say that. Every Bradbury book for myself. She did say that. Okay, where's this hard drive? Hold on, photo out? There's a lot of options in this game, bro. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to look. I'm gonna have to look. I don't want to play that because I don't know if- Thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? Yeah. Okay. Cartier, Bresson, Doino, Hamilton, the greatest. Okay, Max, I see you. Can I open this drawer, though? Thank you. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? Aww. i to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. What did Chloe... Well, no, who knows? Because this is college, right? I was going to say, wouldn't Chloe be at our school with us? But then again, you know, not everybody would do go to the same school. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. 
He's such a goofball. Uh, Max, how you feel about Warren? To Max or whom it may concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drives are of graphic, life-altering, controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care and for the most discriminating viewer. I congratulate, I grongulate you on your taste and eagerly await your in-depth reviews of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Peace, Warren G. Okay, Warren, I'm kind of scared. Max, you want to lay down a little bit? Want to think about life right quick? You know? Fix this is just posture. Ah! This a vibe. Oh, it feels so nice to just relax. This game's a vibe, bro. It's so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. Well, I mean, you went back twice. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Mm. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Are we living in a dream? In a movie scene. Alright, that's what you gotta say. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be here. Like, bro. That song is so trash, but it's catchy. What is this? That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. Oh, that's her and her dad? Aww. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Okay, Max! Uh, why that fit kind of go? Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. This game's a vibe, bro. I know it's a little slow pace right now. I hope you're enjoying as much as I am, bro. What's on the sticky note? Dana left me a little post-it note. Hey, girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just check me down in my room. Uh, I remember Dana's room. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. 218. Uh -huh. I know Dana's room. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna slide there later. Mm. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. Would y'all want to go to Blackwell? Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Oh, this her inspiration board? What a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Uh, this game of vibe, bro. This is one of the games I could just cut on and just play for hours, bro. This game's a vibe, bro. Okay, let's use this laptop real quick before we go to Dana. Let's see. Daniel has so much talent. I oh, wow. It just because it's me. That's fire. Max, you have 12 subscribers? Damn. So Max was born September 21st, 1995. Mm, I wonder how old that makes her now. 1995? She's like 20-something, right? I am so addicted to this site. Look <laughs> at the vintage beauties. Why do they call it camera? <laughs> what the hell? Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Oh, that's fire. Max, thanks for your email and copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I also have a rather eclectic collection of TV cult classic and effed up films on a fat flash drive if you want to check them out. Thanks again for the help. I'm a scientist more than an artist. Now, can you quickly explain to me how a camera works? Be seeing you, Warren G. Okay. That's fire. All right, let's go to let's go to baby girl's room. Oh wait, let's water our plant. How could I forget? You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. <laughs> Drink up. Uh, this game fire, bro. I love this game already. Yeah, cause how is watering a plant gonna have consequences that are negative? They just say that to let you know your actions affect the world. Through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. Hmm. That's some artist stuff though. Oh, instant film. You need some. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. Okay, I think we looked at it. Can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. Oh wait, I could change fits. Hold it's on. Not exactly pretty and pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. Cookies. You want some cookies, Max? You hungry? I love that Mom sent me a fat box of chocolate. <laughs> from a fat box. And slipped in a two hundred dollar gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Aww. Let's see, what's in this drawer, though? Do we need- I believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Mm, me and Max are the same age, for real. Well, at this time. Happy birthday, Maxine. We'll never forget the day you were born and your first smile. It was love at first sight. It's a special day we miss you, but we're so glad you're following your dreams. We love you, your mother and father. Aww. 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 Max, you can play guitar, though? Hold up. What songs do you know? It's not copyright, is, is it? Because, you know, Alex- she was singing, I'm a creep, I'm a weirdo. What what vibes you got for your guitar? Oh. 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 Okay. You say you want me to sing on it? Okay. My name is Max. Uh. 
I spit nothing but facts up. I'm finna put Nathan on his back. Pause. I'm finna put him on his back cause he's whack. Ooh. I mean with my fist. Ooh. That Asian girl's a mmm. Ooh. Cause she wouldn't let me fly her drone. Ooh. I should just send her back home. Ooh. Gonna mess with me. Pull out my phone. Call Warren. He gonna... All right, let's get up. Uh, it, it was cool for a little bit. It was cool for a little bit, but once I brought up Nathan, the, you know, it just went, you know, it just went down. All right, Max, 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 Max I like Max's guitar playing better than Alex. Max ain't talking about, I'm a creep, I'm a weirdo. What oh, you not talking about? None of that. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rotten. I need Dana, though, gangy. Is that, is that the girl I saw with, um, what's his name earlier? Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Yeah, this is so stupid. Juliet, yeah, that's messed up, gangy. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? What's going on? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room what because we're cool. I'm asking why. What did she do? What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. What? How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you don't even out? Aren't we friends? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. Damn. I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Um... Olsen? Juliet... Ju Juliet Olsen. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, uh -huh. Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson... I was gonna pick that, too. Alright. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse. Put it in reverse, Terry. Juliet. Mm -hmm. Oh, Max. Juliet, this is so stupid. Juliet Watson, be nice. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name. Uh, I know you, Gangi. I know you like I know the back of my hand. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Mm. How do you know? I will scream. How do you know? Victoria Chase. You know her. Uh huh. Say that. But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. It's a to Victoria. Right? Like, ask Dana. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. So I have to get Dana out of... Damn. I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Okay, where, which one's Victoria's room? Okay, this game cool. This game cool. Welcome to Black Hill. 221. Victoria's room is 221. This game is cool, cool bro. You can't tell me it's it may be a little slow right now. This game cool. I like this game. 222. 221. There we go. Oh wow, her room was already open for a reason. I should have been new. <laughs> I should have been new. Alright, I need to find what proves Dana's innocence so I could get the flash drive for Warren. Mess up her photos. Speaking of selfies. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do it. That's messed up, Gengi. That's messed up, Gengi. Whoa, I she have no idea Victoria's parents owned the Chase space. Color me impressed. I mean, it's her last name. Let's, let's snoop around. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Dear Miss Chase, thank you for your submission to the Croft Gallery. Fortunately, your work is not compatible with our mission statement. We appreciate your efforts and wish you success in your future endeavors. That's tough, Gengi. That's tough, Gengi. I'm not going to be mean to Victoria. I'm not going to stoop down to her level. Classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. How many tablets? Hate you, Victoria. Damn. How many tablets do she got? She just had one in class. They should call this series aloof. Cold and soulless. Kind of like Victoria. Why did she start talking with a lisp? Does Victoria have a list? A lisp? Lisp? What is this? I'm just okay. Let me stop looking at everything. I know y'all want me to hurry up. My fault, y'all. <laughs> I'm just immersed. Victoria, props for not posting my photo, and for this nice shot. You see, I don't need. Victoria got a thousand, one hundred and twenty-six subscribers on whatever social media this is. She got clout, golly. But see, she didn't post my picture. I'm not going to be mean to her. I'm not going to stoop down to her level. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Taylor, so set to inform me that I totally punked Juliet and Dana just now. All I had to do was mention that Ju to Juliet that I saw a nasty sex from Dana on Zach's phone. Believe me, and so I expected there to be a dorm rampage. Juliet deserved this for slutting Zach away from me. As for Dana, who cares? Get out your popcorn. So, Victoria is really just bitter. 
Victoria is just bitter. Golly, man. See, I'm not I'm not finna get into it with her, bro. I couldn't I couldn't be bothered. Oh, she has the missing person person missing person post? Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Who cares that she's missing? God damn, Victoria. You're you're a crazy woman. But I'm cool. I'm finna get out of here. You better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Yep, I'm out of here with that. Hold on. We got some fits. You know what? Let me not, let me get out of her room. She, Max said we gotta get out of here fast. Let's leave. I'm not finna mess up her photos. Um, let's go. I'm not. I'll tell you, I'm not finna do. Uh, lower down to her level. Uh, Juliet. Um, hold this. Juliet, read this. Juliet, kind of cool too. Hello. Of course. Yeah, you got you got played for a fiddle. Come on, Dana, baby. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. <laughs> you really think I'd mess around with Zach? Right? Isn't she a man's? Stupid jealous. You can't be stupid. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like a black little ninja. Ugh. What Zach has to say about Victoria. Max is really a superhero. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Okay. Uh, she said I could come in. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. You said I could slide? Ah, I was Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. All right, the flash drive is on her d pregnancy test. Hold on, whoa. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Yeah, hold on, let's talk to her before we do start touching stuff in her room. Hey, Dana. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. All right. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. Right? Always hating. Pull that prank on a friend. That's messed up, Gingy. Because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. Mmm. Victoria creeps me out. Oh, you're in the Vortex. To be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. Uh, geeks on top. Files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Really? Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Really? I gotcha. <laughs> oh, so Warren really liked Max, huh? This is both sad and pathetic. I could really just look at this stuff in her room. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write you this so you might not hate me forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I pussed out. If you need any money, let me know, Logan. Logan, you trying to be a sugar daddy. Hold on, pregnancy test. That looks like a home pregnancy test. I'm not finna just pick it up. She pissed on it. I mean, she pissed on it. I better make sure everything is still in there. Okay, so we gotta look through this I file. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Unholy. I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. <laughs> Uh, so you just gotta make sure everything's on here. Where's science homework? Incredible film like great TV, some music, random, not download, party buster. Max, I really have my own folder. Okay. What is it? I'm kind of intrigued about this pregnancy test, though. What is going on? What the hell? Oh, Max, that's mine. <laughs> Thank you. My fault. My fault, OG. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Damn. My fault, gangy. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. Put it in reverse. I could rewind and make it up to her. Wait, hold on. I want to talk to her. Is she mad at me? There's no more gossip for you here. Oh, uh, my fault. So go. My fault, Gengi. I, I overstep. I overstep my boundaries. Okay, there we go. And I checked the US uh, flash drive already and stuff like that. Everything's good. I better make sure everything is still in there. Okay. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Yep. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. I'm gonna talk to her. Make sure we... I heard a rumor about you. Whoa, we can actually press her about this. Okay, hold on. I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. <laughs> what? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. She actually is pregnant. She's actually pregnant. Goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? No, Max is a... Of course. Of course. You my homie. Was pregnant. Ah. Uh... Oh. What about the other? Deadbeat dad? 
You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zach. Logan. Logan. Logan, I know who it is. I know who Sorry it is. Sorry to pry. It's not my business. And I won't be at the game Friday. Not much school spirit, I guess. <laughs> I like your spirit, Max. Uh, anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Okay, Dan, I'll see you. See, now, so Max could really be a master manipulator, bro. Who's texting me, Warren? I can't see, I hope so. I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. The more I text, the longer I take on my way. Bye. All right. So Max could really be a massive manipulator because now I know who the baby daddy is and I know she was pregnant, but I flipped it and said it was a rumor and that it's not my business. Because I recall, I could, I retain all the information and all the items I collect no matter if I go back in time. That's cool, bro. That's fire. This game is amazing. I like this already. <laughs> Hope y'all like it as much as I do.